So good morning to everyone for this wonderful gathering for the idea pitching event named Arunay Idea Thon 2.0, and this is an event uh, which has been conducted in the name of an Institution Innovation Council of Arunay Engineering College, in association with the Computer Society of India Mumbai chapter. So I take this immense pleasure to invite our Vice Chairman Engineer E V Kumaran Sir and respected Registrar Dr R Sathi Silan Sir and our respected and motivated Principal Dr Vijayan Gurumuthi Ayer Sir for this wonderful occasions. I take immense pleasure to invite. today's eminent person from different areas professor dr suresh ashon a chairman of csc mumbai chapter and mr titan gunaseelan who is a founder of enzoe fintech of service private limited from mumbai and i also welcome professor atanu rao choudhury who is a founder of an capsules lab for this wonderful gathering for the program of an idea 2.0 and this particular program is mainly concentrate on three kinds of aspects like how the students can able to develop their ideas and the developing ideas can be taken to the prototype models and the prototype models that they have been taken to the product levels so the three levels of uh, concentration to be made on this idea than especially in 2.0 that is renewable energy internet of things smart vehicles and artificial intelligence with machine learning so all these kinds of crucial topics is been taken by the students of both second years third years and final years for the past one month and they have done a, a little bit of a, a product level Uh, developments and as well as an idea level innovations so i just take appreciate the department of uh, computer science students who has been taken these initiatives and i also thanks to our principal and as well as in management to make a wonderful support for this program so now i request our principal to felicitate the gathering please sir respected engineer ev e. kumaran sir vice chairman of arunay engineering college dr r satyasilan registrar arunay engineering college dr m jyotish kumar head of the department computer science and engineering aec distinguished speakers professor dr suresh a son chairman computer society of india mumbai chapter mumbai professor dr uh, professor atunu rai choudhury sir founder capsule lab kolkata uh, mr titus gunasilan founder messrs zoi fintech services private limited mumbai and uh, respected professors and uh, faculty members and uh, my dear staff and students uh, good uh, good morning to everybody and on behalf of the management faculty staff and students of arun engineering college i extend my warm welcome on this occasion idea thon and congratulations for the program jointly organized by the institutes innovation council and the computer society of india and uh, right quality and uniformity that are the foundations of prosperity sustainability commerce and peace this is a very powerful statement given by the demings who was the father of quality improvement in japan uh, when the quality improvement was very important uh, after the hiroshima and nagasaki bomb blast in japan so the demings philosophies were followed by the japanese so that uh, the japanese uh, uh, you know the <coughs> uh, the turnover was very uh, during 19 50 60 70s so the philosophy i i would like to elicit to our students what is right quality right idea of excellence and unity that are the foundations of prosperity and commerce and peace and idea thon is a short intensive workshop like experience for students to address some of the most pressing technological or engineering challenges economical challenges and the environmental as well as the sustainability challenges of our time so participants work in teams and use design thinking and innovative learning experience to ideate and collaborate on possible solutions so this requires the problem solving skills from the students the importance of research also is focused in this idea thought the study of the materials and the sources to discover the facts what are the facts we have to understand the investigation also very very important the investigation knowledge and skill and uh, what is called the the attitude that uh, requires a research uh, competence among our students that is investigation the carrying out the systematic inquiries idea means a thought or a suggestion about a possible course of action or a mental impression or a, or a belief so invention is creation of new things new designs new process new products new uh, you know the modification of the new systems and creative ability by your intelligence a new creation 
so sharing sharing information and challenging uh, exchanging the ideas these are all the advancement of the idea thon systems so innovation means introduction of new things so about 88% of the economic growth is created by innovation and about 88% of the sustainable innovation is created by sustainable economical growth so you you have to understand the concept of the sustainability the ability of the system uh, work without damage the environment and uh, run long time uh, which meets the needs of the present generation without compromising the ability and efficacy of future generations to meet their own needs which is a me- which is the need of the hour that is a millennium development goal they call by the united nations the united nations sustainable development definition uh, you should understand that is the development that meets the needs of the present generation without compromising the ability and efficacy of future generations to meet their own needs today students tomorrow innovators today students tomorrow entrepreneurs so you you have to uh, get uh, the expertise in this platform like ideathon so this will definitely improve your innovation skills the innovation uh, attitude as well as innovation knowledge so as to make you as a competent uh, you know technologist a competent engineer competent uh, you know technologist as you be know that you know f is equal to ma f is equal to mass into acceleration see the before uh, 150 years the first uh, fly, flight uh, that is a uh, right brothers flight the material was made up of that is uh, the iron iron ferrous alloys and it was very heavy so f is equal to ma means the the energy required to propel the engine was very very high energy and uh, after the innovation many many animals were extinct after innovation of the alloys the mid of 1975 the boeing come up with the innovative aircraft that is made up of aluminum eutectic system copper eutectic system aluminum copper eutectic systems and uh, the weight of the flight was very considerably reduced the energy required to propel the engine was considerably reduced the noise was only 60 dba the right brothers no- uh, flight noise was 125 dba see how after 50 to 60 years of the boeing's innovation experience in aircraft experience they have considerably reduced to 40 to 50 dba noise level and the uh, the material all been changed that is aluminum copper eutectic systems so it means uh, but nowadays the aircraft were considerably reduced by considering the f is equal to ma that is uh, the mass the energy required to propel the aircraft is now the considerably reduced even the noise level have been reduced to 40 dba the material innovated is that is a uh, uh, carbon fiber kevlar fiber composite advanced composite technology where the state of the art uh, aircrafts are now innovated so this way how the successfully the innovation have been captured in our uh, aircraft systems as f is equal to ma so energy required to propel the you know the engines were very large very heavy whereas nowadays the aircrafts or automobiles have been com- continuously innovated and it has been reduced the noise level have been completely reduced the air pollution noise pollution have been successfully com- uh, reduced the reason is the energy consumption f is equal to ma so Uh, uh like that uh, uh, even light weight uh, operating systems heavy weight operating systems the difference between the fog computing and uh, uh, you know the cloud computing and uh, the consideration is environmental aspects the before 1970 usa have considered only two e's concept in all the technological systems that is engineering and economics but they have not complete uh, considered the organizational planning and decision making that is environment national environmental policy act was in, uh, implemented in usa in 1970 so after that uh, most of the policies projects uh, plans programs legislative actions from the usa have considered the environmental impact assessment process which is a systematic identification and evaluation of the potential environmental effects of the proposed projects plans programs legislative actions and uh, policies with respect to the physical environment the chemical environment the biological environment the biochemical environment and the social economical environment the cultural en- environment of the total environment so the sustainable development 
uh, you have three pillars that is environmental stewardship number two social inclusion and economical development so the idea thon should integrate the three e's that is engineering economic and uh, environmental challenges so by which we will be able to improve our economical growth in our systems so the right quality and uniformity that are the foundations of prosperity then commerce sustainability and peace so with these few words i wish you all the best for your bright and distinguished entrepreneurial career thank you one and all thank you sir uh, for your motivation speech uh, on behalf of uh, aruna engineering college and institution innovation council of aruna engineering college uh, we uh, appreciate your motivation sir now i uh, make our the, the innovative and, and dynamic person of our chief guest dr suresh eshon welcome you sir yeah good morning good morning everyone apologies for the delay i come for a program that uh, they extended 10 minutes more sorry so one thing i want to uh, mention on this session that uh, the idea than 1.0 has been started on big of uh, on on what the guidance we get it from our professor uh, suresh sir has been uh, given a motivated that is a trigger that arunay has been started this idea than program so on today i think this is the right time i want to mention that that idea than has been started uh, uh, with the uh, uh, with the idea which has been initially uh, made by our uh, professor the chairman of csa mumbai chapter has initiated this and taken uh, more much of uh, the prototype models that the students want to create it and he has been visited twice to our institution in physical and he has been motivate our students so that is the thing that the students are now come with the uh, prototype model in the version of 2.0 i thank you sir on behalf of aruna engineering college and department of computer science engineering it is great it my pleasure again uh, i will come some more time no issues uh, the expectation is what like uh, let us uh, have this idea than creating more vibes positive vibes in students and let them some feel comfortable uh, from even tirunamalai you know uh, we generally say tvm uh, tiruvannamalai can reach to again uh, tvm takur village mumbai so boy it's that much connect both are tvm so uh, let them have that uh, bridge trying to take it up but again we feel proud where uh, our students where they come out uh, especially in terms of uh, expectations and part of idea than really i thank in this time uh, dr vijayan and uh, Uh, Mr. Titus, uh, where uh, they are also uh, taking their time and uh, they try to give uh, the motivation to the students. Surely, it's a long-term journey. It's uh, what are expected. And again, uh, uh, idea than is not just a thought. It's, it's just a platform set for the students where uh, they can try to connect with the kind of expectation set part of it. Let them focus on some specific uh, four areas where uh, let them have enough uh, refocus. of uh, the digital efforts in terms of uh, supporting the changing customer uh, uh, environment and again bring as much as in terms of uh, new data for artificial intelligence we have something of experience data which is not so uh, reliable and uh, accurate so we are looking forward in terms of uh, the authentic uh, data for uh, new information which builds ai and again uh, simplify the modernized technology that's where we look such solutions from this uh, village where people can bring out as much as simplicity in terms of uh, modernized technology nothing uh, uh, not but the least create as much as a drum beat part of the organization so that the startups and the entrepreneurs can build enormous potential because that's a backbone of uh, our country so we're looking forward more in terms of uh, building and creating more entrepreneurs and uh, try to bring it out that's why mr titus and all will speak a lot more in that uh, i i wish him to create his second uh, 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 development center in tirunamalai where he can have uh, more in terms of profits and other things where the students can uh, put him into his dream and connecting their dreams so that it empowers him part of it that that's a request from our side and surely a lot more in terms of uh, uh the new innovations as committed three top uh, idea than projects uh, we will be trying to uh, facilitate them and uh, trying to create a uh, uh, platform for them so that they can connect and compete with the national level and try to uh, build uh, their own dreams with the right and relevant people so top three people will get and surely the people who participated also will get the certificate so that let them get that what uh, they are looking forward in terms of motivation and a platform which enables them to show their talent and the kind of bright ideas which will take us to the next level so we are open and again uh, we are very proud uh, to be part of such uh, engagement and uh, we're looking forward for the ideas and the kind of uh, disruptions of innovative models from uh, uh, rural india 
that's why we strongly believe uh, the kind of belief behavior which converts us to create business best benefits so uh, looking forward and uh, really thankful to dr jyotish again uh, uh, see the kind of uh, engagement is easy execution is very poor like you would have seen today all the uh, ipls people do have the strategy but very few people apply the strategy apply the thing and trying to execute part of it so i would uh, rate you are uh, doing well in terms of uh, executing things and uh, uh, focusing more in terms of outcomes rather than the results so i would wish you and your team were uh, continuously uh, trying to create enough in terms of the strategy converting more into the kind of outcomes and the expectations set part of it so uh, being part of technology surely we are there we will help you people to create and uh, get into the kind of platform or environment which people put your students into the competition of the expectation thank you sir as uh, as what our professor has been mentioned that um, uh, before we start over the idea that in, in initial stage of 1.0 as uh, we have discussion with, related to the development of this prototype and uh, sir has given uh, some kind of an uh, uh, motivation like uh, as a student or the faculty will need this kind of aspects like a motivation awareness guidance as well as an appreciation i think our professor has been created this motivation awareness and guidance as well as appreciation to our you, our uh, college as well as to the faculties and students so that is the trigger that what our students and faculties are now uh, making that uh, every time when professor has been made we need uh, guidance we need an awareness and, and one point to be very clear we need very uh, clear motivation to the students as well as the faculty i think our professor has uh, created that initiative in arun engineering college as a soil of tirunelveli so i i thanks on behalf of our arun engineering college to make this program to be a wonderful startup same, same here and i wish you all and uh, top 3 people will get uh, the motivation of getting specific uh, programs to be attended and we will try to promote them for the national level and uh, global prospects in terms of their projects letting known for, to the right people in terms of innovation and disruption all the best uh, wishes to all the students who participate and I wish you all like you know the kind of uh, thoughts innovative ideas which converts enough in terms of building this uh, nation into the next level thanks thanks for all valuable time really appreciated and uh, dr roth is related to this anything please disturb us we are at your service thank you sir and, uh, i know uh, uh, titus is there like uh, uh, he is uh, more uh, we learned a lot from him so he is more inspiration in terms of uh, setting things and uh, uh, he has already created a platform uh, keeping more than uh, 75 to 100 people so uh, we expect that kind of it's you know uh, that uh, blessings with uh, the kind of expectation set part of the students will raise the bar of the students expectations and surely create enough in terms of the opportunities which they can convert during the tougher times sir we thank also have an thank you sir thank you sir we also have an another resource person professor atanu rao choudhury who is an founder of an capsules lab and uh, we also have alumni has been joined over uh, professor atanu rao choudhury are you on the line sir ah uh, yes 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 sir. It's a great, great sir. Like, uh, good to see you all. And again, uh, this is a long dream where we want uh, uh, the uh, rural pockets also should have uh, enough impact in terms of the transformation. That's what we are looking for. And we want their engagement and participation. We want them to enjoy the benefits what uh, really government is possessing and the big corporates would like to take it up. So this purely a platform. And really, thanks for all your valuable time setting the trends. and making the students to participate even they will come to know a lot more which is happening up around them and uh, it at the end it matters a lot even 10 people take it up this then that that's what we are looking for it but surely we can look for something more around 90 but uh, dr jyotish will ensure like it should have more than 90 to 100% where we will create it and thanks for all your valuable time and do tell us for what else still we can do part of it so that the students get the benefit and the institutions already is supporting institution is very very supportive where they are trying to uh, put the college in the competition and they put the college in the kind of real and right expectations set part of it. so thanks thanks for all your valuable time and really it's appreciated sir thank you sir for your wonderful words and uh, we expect the what the expectation that you have been making definitely we will make it one step forwarded and do all the activities uh, that will make an innovate and as well as the models to be created for the students so now i request uh, professor uh, mr uh, titus gunasilan who is an founder of zoe fintech service private limited to take over the session please sir good morning everyone good morning sir so i wish uh, i i could see more faces here rather than speaking to the screen uh, and that's fine 
so who is if it is possible, i'll give you company sir i may request yeah i may request all of you to switch on your camera it will be better yeah i want to make it as uh, interactive as possible yes sir so i will not take much of your time right thank you everyone uh, for inviting me here right so i am a small person in front of a great uh, you know in technology side i would say suresh sir is a well known and great giant so in front of him i am a small person I'll, i'll try to add some right um so sir jain so jain a... sir not required sir uh, actually these small people are required <laughs> because this institution wants really small people jain can't do things but jain can only support but real things are done by small people and entrepreneurs entrepreneurs are the real people who can do it corporate only can support that so we are behind you so entrepreneurs are the first are the people who are the backbone of india yes sir continue continue so whenever whenever i spoke to dr shawn um, he always had you know tvm in mind always so today i learned that he is living in tvm and he was he is from tvm so that's great akur village and tiruvannamalai uh, so he always had this uh, you know the rural people in mind i don't know where since he worked in uh, mahindra you know the tractors and other stuff he always got connected to the rural side so that's a great stuff so how uh, uh, i'll just uh, you know quickly explain how our journey started and what we are to- doing here in tirunelveli right so i'm basically from tirunelveli thamira prani thaniya kudichu da valandathu so inge rendu uh, i just moved to mumbai in 1995 so it has been about 27 years now so i've been spending about 25 years in the corporate world um you know heading it in um, you know companies like ifl anandra tj and financial and all um i just had a, always had a had something in mind something was missing in life so we just uh, wanted to start of my colleagues uh, um wanted to support me so we just started so we just wanted to experiment something which um, you know many people have already done that but uh, in our view so i am basically from a, not from a business family or anything so my parents are teachers so always had that middle class mentality and this insecurity security always had right stable job stable income even after having you know marriage kids and they are in higher studies and all so you know it is it is very difficult to take that call and started this um, journey but we always wanted to give it back to the society right so i am from tirunelveli so i just wanted to do something here uh, because I, tirunelveli is earlier uh, known for all those communal violences and all those caste related violences and all right so i have seen you know even for um, you know, there used to be murders when i used to go to college there used to be murders for even uh, over 10 rupees and all so it used to happen that way so we just wanted to do something here um and i had trust here in 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 our kids so especially tamil nadu kids you know we have something uh, special in terms of uh, uh, so we just wanted to do something different here that's how the journey started so we invested we we had to invest about a year uh, into this so any earlier i was little skeptical about uh, you know how these kids will uh, cope up with the new latest technologies because especially in the arts colleges and uh, you know some engineering colleges where we picked up these kids what we found was there is a big gap between the reality the the actual need in the market versus the uh, the subjects and uh, the training given by the colleges to the students there is a there is a huge gap so we need to fill that gap and we we had to actually many things so we had to we had to ask them to unlearn before they get in with the new technology but surprisingly um, i should agree that uh, you know within about 4 to 6 months time these kids have become uh, champions i would say so all the latest technology we just through them uh, you know we just told them to learn and once the basic foundation was set in the first three months after that i just randomly ask some of the team uh, like three four people i pick them 
i just put them onto a room i'll tell them that you know in the next four days you should be able to learn this new technology i just put them onto that surprisingly these kids come out so what what was lacking was only the communication part so we took care of that as well so we have soft skill training english training communication training all that so we just started with all that and now i have got a well trained engineers of 50 another 20 is already um, you know onboarded so about 70 plus members we already have uh, onboarded in tunnel valley we are expanding uh, we had one office now we are we have taken one more office so that's how we are now all these kids are now um, you know uh, you'll be surprised to know the kind of projects they work on right the the wealth management platform that they have built these kids have built the wealth management platform they don't have any knowledge about the financial industry financial services industry they don't have zero knowledge they don't have, they have zero knowledge and uh, they, co- they they came up very well and they have created a full fledged wealth management platform and this is now being implemented in a very large private private bank so that's how we are creating opportunities there in mumbai and these kids are uh, backing us from sitting here and they are able to do um, all new latest technology you can say that uh, you can name the latest technologies all the kids are now trained for that so, right so that's how we we could set it up right uh, so you have started very well so like uh, dr suresh shan and all he has met so many people he visited so many places countries and all you know the ground reality and he is the right person to guide you and you have started the journey very well right you have the right uh, management in place i think fantastic for you people right just participate that's the only thing i can say and um, only uh, my, my humble request is um, you know we are not uh, uh, i'm not i'm not the right person to advise and all uh, my uh, humble request is when you start this journey of entrepreneurship um, few things you need to keep in mind right so first of all uh, yes yes suresh no no I, i just said that uh, it's like a tirnal valley we come uh, in our mind it comes more in terms of periyar uh, maniyamai uh, so uh, and uh, uh, try to bring out as much as on the uh, sweet side alwa so uh, so still good things are there and again uh, 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 entrepreneurship why because the similar thoughts uh, uh, you are the right fit for them because uh, those people uh, want to come up in life in terms of entrepreneurship and they don't want to do something great, bigger with the high corporates so that's why you really fit in so it's very uh, uh, grounded from your side to say nothing you are done but we are seeing from the other side it's it's, it's a a lot more uh, you are done for your uh, native uh, tunnel valley you kept in mind you would have easily done the same in bombay but still you still felt like no it's required in tunnel valley hats off to you and uh, our request is uh, uh, tunnel valley is famous for periyar uh, no periyar maniyamai so uh, my my mba is from that side so uh, and again uh, we are looking forward from your side why not your second or third office in tirunamalai where uh, we surely will lift because we light a lamp on the top of the mountain surely we will treat every small thing which lights lamp on the top of the mountain and really that expects you also to uh, uh, give us a chance where the students can try to uh, put themselves and uh, try to build a strong environment for you on that so uh, you are grounded but still we know your 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 uh, uh, and that and i again request you during uh, some time you can visit our native we will be uh, uh, welcoming you and your family where you can see the reality how uh, tirunamalai is rural but still uh, uh, no uh, we can do something we can light something on uh, at least uh, 10 to 15 guys that matters a lot yes sir on behalf of karuna engineering college and oh. uh, on behalf of suresh sir as, as a soil of tirunamalai always we are welcome to our uh, place sir actually no 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 sure absolutely suresh sir is always there right so we can always look at uh, explore that option right so it's not about rural actually you know but i have seen uh, rural kids are much more fighters i can say you know i have seen that spirit in them i have seen that so uh, my uh, you know style of interviewing is uh, slightly different so titus yeah, we are yes, all sorry, titus we are the right examples of rural we are all from that place so you are <laughs> exactly so, so people really have that inspiration but only thing we have to create because we took 20 years to reach it we want them to reach in that two months to two years that's the only dream yeah that's right yeah, we can always explore there right 
so there is plenty of opportunity i would say that you know suresh sir can you know support that there plenty of opportunity everywhere you know wherever i spoke you know we have not spoken to many people in uh, in our circle also um you know when we connect with uh, other counterparts in the other companies other uh, companies cios and ctos we feel that you know these guys are you know demanding a lot of technology pool but it's not available today so people are not uh, ready it's not available today so there's a lot of mass mass scale uh, resignation period is going on so we are able to support them in in some way so that's how we took 23 people uh, this year so we'll be adding more uh, people in the future right so we'll uh, definitely support you this kind of initiatives so definitely you guys are doing a great job in the startup world startup world you know as i said there are a few things you need to keep in mind when you are starting a, a journey you just always keep this in mind that you know uh, you are not alone and you cannot achieve alone so uh, the the world is connected and uh, you need lot of support from people like uh, you know suresh sir and all you, you can always uh, keep him as a mentor you can always guide you out but when you are starting a journey at the same time you need to have your friends with you you need to have at least three or four friends so they will all always support you so i'll just uh, i'll not take much of your time so if anybody has any questions you can ask me otherwise i'll just say a few words and conclude here if a students are wants to ask any question uh such so students want to take over uh, their uh, product or uh, pro prototype to the product that's what uh, uh, previously uh, two days back uh, professor atonach roy chaudhary also has taken over some initiatives on how the ideas to be taken to the prototype as well as a product so if you have any kind of a input that what the students can able to take their projects level to take into prototype models so that input will be good for the students to know about that so from the prototype to products yes sir right so see any prototype or product when you are you know ideating something you know we what we looked at it i can always tell you that i am not an expert so there are experts here so they can answer your question but what we can say is that you know we always see that is, is there any value to the customer so we don't talk about um, the, the the feasibility or anything of that sort or technology technology everything is feasible so we always look at that there is a value if there is a value there are buyers so if there is a value if you are if you want to make it as a product there are people you need to just connect with the right people that's it that's the only thing you need to right so um you make friends in that way follow and mentor sir as you told about that uh, communication that the, that you have a set of team that you have been developed uh, related to communication what the rural uh, students are really expecting other than the technical aspects uh, while they want to communicate with an hr they need a communication so what kind of a suggestions that you can given for the final years as well as for the third years uh, what way they can improve their communication skill as uh, as in the daily life actually right so don't prepare yourself i would say that so my way of interviewing is different so I, i can always say that don't prepare for interviews just be yourself so i would say that you know just be yourself communicate in the language that you are comfortable with don't don't worry about english so i always um, you know we don't want fake people right we always reject fake fake people even the you know best of students i have rejected just because they were faking in front of us so just be yourself just be natural so that's perfectly okay at the same time english is the uh, language which is accepted everywhere so you need to learn that right so i studied all my life in tamil medium right so i can also speak in uh, english right i hope i am speaking fairly good english so you can anybody can learn that language right but that that is not the first thing but learn that it's not a big deal right that's the thing so i'll just uh, um, uh, say a few things just apart from the uh, technology the uh, side of it i'll just say so there are five areas we focus on like everybody wants to be happy right? and of the day, you need to be joyful you need to be happy so my work as a ceo in my company is only one thing is that you know i want to make uh, my people happy because even during this great period of resignation i didn't lose even a single person from my team 
So all the people who, whom I have recruited, everybody is there with me. Just one person left and he is also joining back again because everybody is happy here in our company. If you see the name Zoe, Zoe is a, uh, is a Greek word, means life. So we want to make slightly different from other corporates. So we want to make people happy and all. So you know, when you have want to be happy, there are five things you need to look at it. There are five areas of uh, uh, your life you need to look at. You don't just look at the money part or you know hard work part or anything. So it's just five areas you should see. There is a, a physical aspect you need to see. So you need to uh, uh, be healthy always, right? Mental, mentally, you need to be strong. So you need to li uh, listen to the right things. You need to be, um, uh, you know, listening and the mind should be having good ideas rather than all the things. You need to take care of your mind. Then spiritual, you must be spiritually attached in whatever way you want. You do that, right? Emotionally, you should you should have your right friends and right family members to support you at all the times. Emotionally, right? Then socially also, we are all social elements, right? social animals, so we need to be social. So all these five elements you need to focus on, not just one area, right? Don't get into that, then you will get frustrated at one point of time. So just equally focus on all the elements. That is what in our company also, we look at all this, right? So we have meditations, we have some yoga sessions, everything we take care. So from morning to evening, you, you see that every two hours, there is some activity happening here, every day basis. And we have every six months, we have a large celebrations happening with their family or with, uh, with uh, we take them out, the kids and put them onto the five-star hotels. You know, we, we make, make, make sure that they are happy. That's how I'm able to retain all the people, all the people who have joined me, nobody left, right? So that's because of that. So near zero attrition I have. That's because of that. So even when you start your entrepreneurial journey, even you should take care of all these five elements, right? physical, mental, emotional, spiritual, and social, all these elements you should focus on and take care of that. Be joyful, help others, right? Enjoy your day, right? So all the best. Thank you, sir, uh, for your wonderful speech that you've given over to ignite our minds of the students as well as the faculties, as I can able to make it in one word, the simplicity, actually. That's what I can learn from you, sir, actually. And uh, uh, as I told, uh, heard about the name about Zoe, the, that what you told about the, uh, the life, about the Greek word. Yesterday, if I just go about the company name and I go for some kind of investigation, why SAR has been given that Zoe, actually. And fine tech is for the financial technology. Am I right, sir? It's a fine tech. Yes. So that's what I've been go through about the, the name, what you have given over it. So life related to the financial technology for taking up any banking sectors or any cryptocurrencies, sir, actually. That's the word that you've given over for the company. Fintech. So what Zoe is? Yeah, yeah. yeah sorry. Huh. Yes, sir. Zoe yes. is uh, the Greek word for life, right? So I wanted to create a lively environment. So the life begins here as soon as you entered, enter Zoe uh, gate. So that's how uh, we, I wanted that, right? Fintech is uh, because I spent all my life, uh, all my even the other co-founders, all of them spent their life into financial technologies financial side. So we want to create something uh, good at there. So that's what we have created. Even our product is uh, wealth management. So FinTech is uh, there. That is our life. So we, we just added that. Thank you, sir. So I, I make my, uh, on behalf of Aruna Engineering College, I, I thanks to Professor Suresh who has been identified the right person for this particular program. And uh, we get more inputs on this particular program, especially from uh, the people uh, like you as given uh, different kinds of aspirations and as well as an input for the students, how the students can want to make it their originality level. That's what we also make some kind of inputs. Be original and have at least a little bit of uniqueness on the product as well as on your characteristics. That's make an identification by the people like you and make their life to be to the next step actually. Thank you, sir. And uh, I also uh, take uh, opportunity to make Professor Atan Rao Chaudhary to make few words about the program. Please, sir. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Professor Jyotish. I was hearing what uh, uh, the eminent speakers had to say before me, and uh, I was just nodding my head in agreement all through this while. Uh, I'll pick up on three points. The first point is what uh, uh, Dr. Suresh mentioned is, uh, you know, the concept of organizing a hike, um, um, an ideathon itself, right? From a concept 
to the first version of the of the of the event to the second version of the event things don't happen overnight right the journey from an idea to its execution takes time it takes patience and uh, uh, there are often many things that uh, uh, you know um, a lot of downturns as well right so it is it is important to understand that uh, not every try is going to be successful in the first go but that does not mean that we lose hope right so that's the first thing uh, the second thing i wanted to pick up was what on what uh, professor ayer had mentioned earlier on in terms of uh, you know uh, force equals mass into acceleration and uh, that going back to that second law of thermodynamics right something that we uh, scarcely remember these days right uh, entropy as the ability of a system to produce useful work right in the world of business as well right the work is the value that you are generating for society and uh, 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 with respect to that you can only generate value if you know you are at a, at at more you know if if in, a, in an internal combustion engine the temperature was the same as the outside temperature that piston would never be released so there is no value there is no work that you can create so even in society when you are creating value the way value gets generated is when it solves a need so something like a facebook today which actually does not make anything is more valuable than a coca cola which has been around for 100 years today the world is flat and you have you know coming in this age where there is a digital fabric in society it means that, that your reach towards society is way more right you can get to anybody's mobile phone today uh, without a brick and mortar uh, uh, store without the capital investments that was required earlier on so that's a lot of uh, that's a lot of opportunities that's a lot of opportunities and you know what we are witnessing today is the digital economy is the electronic organization organizations that are no longer bound by geographies organizations that are no longer bound by hierarchies right that's the freedom you operate in today and that is very very essential to um, understand right when i hired my first uh, uh, recruit my my boss asked me one thing he told me you know why don't you check with the recruit what their what their family used to do right what their parents do if their parents were reasonably well off and they did not make it to an iit the drive wasn't there if their parents did not have the means but yet they went to a you know they 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 went through the struggling process they are your gems they are the people who will deliver for you they are the people who will be with you when you want them right that is what each and every one of you that struggle you know uh, uh that struggle that you're going through right now is what is making you is what is uh, is your spirit right and that is who you are when you present that genuine self to a, a potential recruiter right that is what they're looking for right? entrepreneurship is a behavioral act right the, the journey of entrepreneurship is not not about starting the company from day one it's a it's the way you start looking for opportunities it's the way where anything and everything that you are seeing around you suddenly becomes a monetizable opportunity uh, where you know the, the the very problems that you face are problems that are maybe faced by millions of people around you right so never think that you are alone or never think that a problem is too trivial we cannot bring in uh, solutions that were developed in the west solutions that were developed in china into india because india is different our needs are different our society is different right we have to be able to create solutions which are hyper local which addresses the problems that we have right nobody else is going to come and do that so in that sense that is where we are uh you are ready to uh, uh make those pitches and uh, you know there are no wrong answers here the attempt that you have made in order to give a uh uh give a life to your to your ideas right just remember today that everything that you see around you even a pen that you see is somebody's idea somebody sat around and thought that this is what the color of the of the handle should be this is what the color of the plastic should be right this is somebody's idea and from that idea it has become a product it it is a journey it is a lot of learning and in this journey you learn a lot of things right uh, so anything in this journey is a learning so there is no, there's nothing that can go wrong from here on so with that i'll i'll hand it over to uh, professor jyotish and uh, uh, to 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 go ahead with the uh, rest of the program 
thank you sir uh, for your wonderful presence over over here so i thanks all the uh, guests and all the experts to be available over on today's session and make this program to be a, a successful startup yes sir no i just want to add your two questions to uh, titus in terms of uh, you said uh, you want that patent and the product like in terms of how to create that surely we'll help you out uh, we will even uh, uh, make that product more uh, visible and viable product to customers so we will help the students let them come out with the idea surely we will participate engage with them and uh, make that product at least top 3 whatever uh, uh, merits you people gather with we will be with them to create a patent and a product type towards the customer business and again uh, you said how to improvise the communication uh, i like last time we suggested only create a teams internally a b c d where a will continue to uh, uh, support the idea b will slightly Uh, reverse that idea c will protest that idea d will have the 360 degree different view of the idea if that is put in uh, visibility of a uh, students comes to know a uh, same product with the different uh, uh, visions and different uh, information about the product will give more clarity to them and surely it will improve the communication and uh, uh, this keeps on uh, giving a mindset also for them to say everything to be debated made logical to the people convince the people and accept and adopt it so it matters a lot that quality generally gives them when they join corporate even their entrepreneurship they can listen to the people who are with them they can even think about uh, so many other things about a small uh, content so create that uh, communication again like all suggested language doesn't matter it's more to do with concepts it's more to do with uh, ideation of localization let them have at least problems for uh, themselves like uh, like uh, other eminent speakers said very clearly no need to innovate or disturb something of or uh, something global let them think for that local problems which will put us solutions towards globally and let them focus more for uh, you know global presence using the same solution which is going to address their local problems so uh, which i would want to take it and again uh, right uh, rightly pointed out in india education is more to do with the blood and sweat blood and sweat of parents blood and sweat of kids blood and sweat of faculties means teachers again blood and sweat of the industry also so until this is not properly evaluated properly connected properly made available in the right sense this blood and sweat is going to go away so let everybody feel it it somebody's blood and sweat is part of it and everybody's time money efforts is part of it so that generally gives them more clarity even at this level they can appreciate somebody's time somebody's efforts somebody's money that's what the reality in terms of entrepreneurship bonds in everyone and they can focus more in terms of their life leading towards an entrepreneur full fledged entrepreneur making them comfortable in terms of delivering what they are supposed to back to you mr jyotish thank you sir thank you sir so i think this program at least uh, make it to be initiate of a, a little bit of an entrepreneurships uh, with the name of an institution innovation council and as well as uh, the motivation from uh, different experts thank you sir and uh, thank you professor suresh sir and thank you professor uh, titan gunasilan sir and uh, professor atanu roj choudhury sir for the wonderful presence and make this program to be a good startup and we have an uh, 10 to 15 teams are available on today's session that they are going to present over on different ideas and forthcoming uh, monday they have an another 15 teams they are going to present it on the field of renewable energy iot and smart vehicles as i discussed with professor titus gunasilan sir and once all things to be recorded sir i will send you and uh, make your valuable inputs for that so that we can move forward and make some productivity and as well as a good initiative in future thank you sir Sure. We'll get all the participants will get certificate and top three will get the uh, benefits in terms of putting the projects to the uh, uh, global level. Actually, we work for that product with patent for the relevant industry also. Yes, sir. All yes, sir. To all the uh, participants and uh, to the institution which they have taken so much efforts initiative towards this. Thanks. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you all. <laughs> so we can start the session. Uh, we uh, we are going to invite our uh, the great alumni of our institution who is one of our uh, iot trainer uh, mr amit or you yeah good morning sir good morning yeah, can morning. you power on your camera because our students yeah, want to see sure, sir. how you do hi everyone yeah i am doing fine 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 how are so, you sir so yeah so i think uh, before two years back we have started this kind of initiative but uh, we have started with a different name like an iots and we have uh, Uh, done different kinds of so that initiative uh, like you and as well as shiva divesh as well as shivani 
so uh, that triggers now the present final years as well as the juniors now they are brought up with what we expected on that particular day so i am happy to make you to be on this uh, uh, make this particular session uh, with eminent experts to be available in this session and uh, we have 10 teams available uh, with that and amit on behalf of department of computer science i welcome you as a project engineer from wipro so what is your experience in the past 6 months while you join over oh. yeah it's really great actually uh, when we start working we we start knowing how, uh, how whatever we have read how it is going to be executed in real time world uh, how team works uh, is very important when we are working in uh, uh, on real project so there are lots of things we will uh, what we learned in uh, college that is going to help in the in real industry as well so uh, it will take time but uh, we will adjust ourselves okay And so thank you uh, to you all, <laughs> all the faculties there who who has helped us. So so now the team, whatever you are, I mean, however it should be connected with the college as well as to the department. So that's what the department as well as the college is expected from you, actually. So now I I make the the first team. Uh, the name of the team will be called as a Dream Agro, uh, from the second year uh, section. Uh, they are to uh, choose a domain of an artificial intelligence. with the project title car parking space counter and it has been uh, guided <clears throat> by and staff mrs pratibha and the trainer from the uh, final year ms j abirami and the team mates are harini and uh, kopi sunita and kokilavani and indumari they are on the line i think so so you can start over the session and uh, amit you can take over the session now so any valuable inputs uh, you want to give it for our students amit regarding the industrial expectations uh, there is uh, actually the, the first thing that when we are in college we are really afraid of things that how it is going to work in the industry and how we uh, we will be able to get uh, we will be able to get those jobs or not so that thing should not be there in the mind itself it is not uh, a rocket science or something like that so we can get it so be casual be normal there is nothing to worry about it that is the only thing i will suggest later they will know everything thank you and they are smart enough okay so the team uh, dream agro you can take over the session and present your slides and make your idea pitching okay sir welcome to idea ton 2.0 i am harini from second year csc department followed by me indumadi gopi sunita kokilavani my mentor is mrs j pradipa assistant professor of computer system department in this modern world everything we wish to execute faster so that we came across a project under car parking space counter using a domain artificial intelligence artificial intelligence is a simulation of human intelligence process by machines artificial intelligence programming focuses on three cognitive skills learning reasoning self correction AI can be categorized as weak or strong. It was found as an academic discipline in 1956. It is a theory and development of computer system. Examples of AI are Google Maps and ride hailing application. Problem statement It is difficult to finding parking spots in public places because of lack of parking spots. High number of traffic jams is happening. Time wasting in searching parking spots and more fuel are consumed while driving around parking lots, and it leads to pollution. Next slide followed by my colleague Kokilavani. now we can see about our idea in this project we are going to create a parking space counter we will find how many total cars are present and how many space are vacant to park the driver also don't know how many are there and where to find a parking division for his car an available parking space due to tremendous increase of occupancy of cars 
the analog is when driver enter center parking lot first thing that the driver do is looking forward of some sign to telling that the parking is fully occupied partially occupied or vacant this application will determine how many cars are there and how many parking spots are available next slide we can see about free request site PyCharm, PyCharm is an integrated development environment used in computer programming, speci specifically for the Python programming language. PyCharm is more intensive, which may be worth it when it comes to large projects. Python is a dynamic, high-level, free, open source and interpreted programming language. Working Python program is easy. Machine learning is a language understood by a computer. Deep learning is a types of machine learning and artificial intelligence that indicates the way human gains certain types of knowledge. Now we can see about algorithm of this project. On this algorithm, we can have three inputs. Denote, T denotes optimized property of parking space. G denotes types of parking space. N denotes neurons. That is free space. As a train, training data, the optimized property of parking space is provided as an input. According to this property, we can have three targets of neuron networks that is available space, unavailable space and working parking space. On this training data and target, neural network is trained using neurons that is next state as a carrier which helps to carry out the information from one layer to another layer. Next slide is about flowchart. Initially, to parking, to park a car first, we need to find available parking area and location of the car. Suppose if the car parking area is full, it will terminate. Then after some time, if any availability is there, it will count number of parking car in that area. Else, it dis display no parking space is available. Then it will select nearest car parking distance so that we can find nearest parking spot. Finally, it displays, then the process is ended. Now we see the demo of this project. This is the code of our project. CV2 is used to capturing video. Pickle. It is process. It is the process where project. Python object hierarchy is converted into a wired stream. It is used for serializing and deserializing Python object structure. CV zone. It is easy to run image processing and AI function. NumPy. It stands for numerical Python. It is used to perform a wide variety of mathematical operation of an algorithm. Total slots for car parking are 69. Now we can see number of slots are available in car parking. We move on to the topic future enhancement. This project can be enhanced for tracking the vehicles spent on the roads to differentiate the vehicles from VIPs and staff. The camera can be used for security. By using OpenCV, we can find where the car is parked and also we can find number of vacancy available in parking system. The future of the parking system is expected to be significantly influenced by the arrival of automated vehicles. Several cities around the world are already beginning to trial self-parking vehicles, specialized AV parking lots and robotics parking wallets. Here we break down some of the major benefits that a parking system provides to drivers advantages. Less fuel is wasted. Drivers are directed straight to an available parking spot. Therefore, they waste fewer kilometers driving around in circles looking for vacant parking space. Save money. When in search of parking space, you will save on fuel waste resulting in spending less money on petrol. Saving time. By driving fewer kilometers when in search of parking space, you will save valuable time when can be spent on work or hobbies. Increase in safety. Drivers can be less distracted looking around for a spot because they know where, where they can park their car. It reduces stress while searching for a parking space. Having uncertainty and pressure to find parking, parking spot 
near your destination can be very stressful and it can be reduced reduce search traffic on the street it will benefit traffic flow and will reduce congestion in neighborhood with an un under capacity in parking space thank you so much for all your polite attention my special thanks to our hod sir dr jyotish kumar for giving this wonderful opportunity to present our idea in idea tan even thank you sir for your support and i would also like to thank my de dear guide ms abhirami and mr ajit kumar and also our organizers mr kartikeyan mr anbarsan and ms gayatri thank you all if any queries you can ask sir hi gobi uh, this is amit hi sir yeah so i was asking that uh, for this project you are using image processing for ident identifying the car right yes sir okay suppose uh, uh, instead of car if i put something else uh, any human is there in in place of that uh, parking slot or any other uh, thing like uh, if i put a bike instead of that will it be able to identify whether uh, the slot is empty or full what will it do on that uh, scenario in future enhancement we will come across over it sir okay okay that's it okay anyway uh, this looks good so try to work on that uh, and uh, try to uh, means uh, get the answer which i asked whether it will be able to uh, identify or not okay yeah anyway uh, all the team members uh, they did really well thank so, you sir thank you sir yeah so we have a next team uh, the team name virtual velocity uh, the team uh, members are guru hasan imran khan and asal hasan asif with the project title of an object identification using raspberry pi which is mentor by mr zuma devi ma'am and the trainers from the final year mrs k abhi aparna actually so guru hasan is on the line Yes, sir. I am on the line. Yeah, you can take over the session. Thank you. Good morning, everyone, and uh, welcome to our presentation. <coughs> Let me start by saying few few words about our team background. Myself, B K Guru Asan, second year C S C Arun Engineering College. My teammates M Imran Khan, second year C S C Arun Engineering College, and N Ashif, second year C S C Arun Engineering College. Our team name Virtual Velocity. Our mentor name Mr. Swami B Madhavi, Assistant Professor of Department of C S C. And we would like to thank to our coordinators, uh, Kartikeyan, Anbarasan, and Gayatri. Oh, <clears throat> now we uh, we move into our uh, project. Our uh, our domain is artificial intelligence. The project domain is artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence is the ability of computer or robot controlled by a computer to do tasks that are usually done by humans. because they require human intelligence and discernment the tech tycoon elon musk states that ai is a fundamental risk to the existence of human civilization the next slide is problem statement object detection is the problem of finding and classifying a variable number of objects on an image object detection is a difficult program difficult problem in the field of computer vision it requires computers to look at an image or individual frame from a video identify any object of interest and then classify each objects this technique is useful for tracking people say at a crosswalk tracking faces for facial recognition looking for obstacles in a self driving car and helping robots to identify objects it can manipulate and we move into our idea the main aim of our idea is in the ras in the project we are using we are going to do object identification and animal detection using raspberry pi 4 by using our model it helps to minimize the work of humans in the field of security guard and it is difficult to guard the area situated nearly to the forest area like tea estates etc they are having the people the people who are living in these areas having threat about wild animals our model helps to guard this guard these areas without involvement of peoples and our and the prerequisite is followed by my teammate imran khan here we are going to discuss about in pre recursive our project for this project types of uh, components there are two types of components hardware components and software components in hardware components we need raspberry pi 4 model b in 
spy camera model to give input to program and type c charging cable to provide a power supply and the hdmi cable to get the output from the raspberry pi to the monitor in software components we require raspberry pi buster os because it gives better performance to comparing with another raspberry pi os next we need open cv open cv is the heart of our project it is used to detect and uh, identify the object captured from the camera model and uh, we need tony python idle to execute python program to the output now our team at ashi will be continue i am going to explain about performance specification of our project these are the these are the hardware components we are using in this project in this slide we should our components image for the better understanding of listener now we are going to see about system architecture of our project this is a basic setup of our project by connecting the raspberry pi 4 with raspberry pi pi camera module now our team mate in imran will continue now we will see the flow chart of our project firstly we start by initializing the pi camera followed by it we will set uh, the arm position then the video streaming process is started if the image is detected the object processing is done the fit uh, the feature extraction is verified if the desired object is grabbed and the object is very object is plotted then the scanning process is continued if the object is not plotted then it will scan for new project new, new object now we will see the demo video of our project <laughs> This is the main component we are using in our project namely Raspberry Pi model B. These all are the inner configurations of Raspberry Pi. We are using Raspberry Pi camera module to get input to the program. It is not mandatory to use Raspberry camera module. We can also use webcam also. In Raspberry Pi, there is a port to insert the camera module by using FFC ribbon cables. By using this project with Raspberry Pi makes it overheat. So we implement some cooling systems to fix the heating issues. Connect the Type-C cable for power supply and connect the HDMI cable to get output from the Raspberry Pi 2 monitor. Here we are going to do some software setup. Before starting the program, we ensured that the camera module is enabled in the interface. We give some terminal commands to install the softwares which helping in the field of object detection and identification like TensorFlow and OpenCV. After the terminal process completed, check the OpenCV software installed properly. We downloaded the files which contains material helpful for object detection or identification process as a zip file. After the zip file downloaded, we extracted the zip file to get programming codes. By running the python code on Tony Python idle.
we got our project output thanks to all to give the wonderful opportunity to our team we are now going to see about our future enhancement using our project by using rotating cameras by using rotating cameras uh, by using the camera module used in it can be cover particular area only by using to take uh, by using rotating cameras we can cover the huge area under our surveillance by doing with some upgradation in our project we can connect the raspberry pi with mobile devices to get notifications implementing in high crowded places like festivals shopping malls and ceremony to detect the person with the help of mini satellite we can able to cover more areas under our model but this is more expensive to uh, to free people from tedious jobs that will be done more efficiently and effectively by machines now our team at ashik will continue now we will see the advantage of our project animal detection in agriculture autonomous driving vehicle de detection with ai in transportation medical features detection in healthcare people detection in security these are the advantage of our project thank you thank you for giving us the wonderful opportunity sir if you have any queries you may ask me now sir yeah okay so it looks good and uh... in this way uh, if we apply it uh, on the real life nearby uh, any forest area then it will really stop uh, human and animal conflicts so it's really good for them and so uh, i had one query like uh, suppose we have uh, multiple animals at in one frame will it be able to find them as well or or is yes, there sir. any way? we can able to find we can able to okay. find okay and uh, we are already pre, -pre install some uh, objects names okay. that will uh, helps to find out the objects okay so uh, in that uh, we will be using some of the uh, pre existing library or something to identify some limited amount of uh, uh, objects so if i want to add some extra thing like uh, suppose uh, in that existing library uh, some elements might not be uh, included in that so if i want to add uh, the specific image of that particular animal is there a way to yes sir improve, we can right yes sir we can add already we are uh, installed 91 objects okay to detect uh, if we need some uh, new objects we can able to easily insert them okay okay that's good that's good thank you sir thank you sir thank you so much uh, see i have a query any specific algorithm is been available uh, other than raspberry pi any specific that is a controller uh, any specific algorithm that you been available for this uh, identification of an object detection Sir, we already listed that in demo video, sir. Okay. So, what are the other future enhancements that you can do it on this particular uh, model? Future enhancement means, uh, sir, lots of uh, uh, it gives lots of uses to us, sir, to monitor, uh, to monitor our pet animals or uh, monitor our childrens. And uh, the main, the main idea of uh, implement this object detection is to guarding purpose. Okay. Uh, if uh, I mean, in some theater in some theater smalls they are uh, don't allowing uh, some pet animals or any other uh, domestic animals uh, inside their uh, inside their community so it, uh, it helps to detect that uh, if any other uh, restricted objects came into their uh, came into their community so it uh, detects and uh, send the notification to the corresponding admin okay Uh, Amit, I think this is the uh, one of the team that they have been come with Raspberry Pi, and they have some basic knowledge, and they have been uh, uh, done from the starting of second year itself. But we identify through this uh, idea, then we identify this set of team, uh, Guru Vas and other team members, uh, those who have been initiated with an Raspberry Pi. Okay, thank you, students.